All right, everyone, Sonic here, and I'm going to teach you how to make BRSTMs. This method is going to be using Wavasaur, Loose Hunters Converter, VGM Stream, Rawbox, and some other crap. But, all right, first, you're going to need a song that's either an MP3 or WAV format. That's the only um, type of file that Wavasaur supports. All right, I already have this song as a BRSTM, but I'm going to use it as an example. Ride Them Pain from Guilty Gear, one of my favorites. All right, you see how the waveform, most of it is touching the top and bottom of the screen. That usually means that the song is loud enough. Sometimes songs are lower than that, and you would have to go and increase the volume a little bit until the waveform is touching both the top and bottom, or at least most of it. And another thing you want to do before you do anything, you want to go to the beginning of the song and delete all the silence. Go to the tiniest part of the waveform that's that's not flat. Select selection range from zero to there. Delete. All right, so all the silence is gone. All right, and let's listen to this song and see if we can find some loop points. Sometimes you can look at, you can eyeball the waveform, and you can pretty much try to guess where it might sound similar. So these two parts look really similar. Well, these three part, these four parts look really similar. Similar. So I'm gonna check them all out. Compare it with this. Alright, so I found two regions that sound very similar, so this is where I'm going to look for my loop points. Let's try up here. Alright, that looks nice right there. Let's zoom in a little bit. Alright, what you want to do, you want to mark down this point right here for later. Now you want to go to this other part over here towards the end, which would be the loop ending point. And this is what I think might be a good place to mark it. All right, let's mark this here. All right, now I'm going to double click inside this area and make sure that Wavasaur is set to loop. Actually, you know what? Just play the song. Double click in here. And now it'll try to loop. It'll loop the entire highlighted region. I'm going to see how it sounds. See if it's seamless or not. Alright, it sounded a little fast to me, so I'm going to go and check that out. So you can get right on this peak right here. Alright, I'm going to mark that down and move this out the way. Now over here. Oh, okay, it looks like I was a little back away from the peak. Let me try this. All right, and I'll mark that there. All right, you want to make sure there's no markings in between the two new marks you just made. All right, let's try. Uh, let's see how this sounds. Try it again, just to be sure. Alright, that sounded good to me. Alright, while this region is highlighted, 
You want to go up here and click the L, the loop point creator button, and mark your loop points. Okay. Now you want to save this file as an L wave. It's very important that you save it as an L wave. On Windows XP, this isn't a problem. I'm not sure about Windows 7, but on Windows, I mean, I'm not sure about Windows Vista. On Windows 7, you have to save it as an L wave, though. So. For the file type drop down menu, go all files dot l wave. All right. Now, you want to go to the folder that you saved this in. You find the l wave and go to VGM to BRSTM. Let's see where I put this. Okay. In the description, you'll the, all the links will be there for all these files. You want to go and drag this file onto BRSTM Make. The nice thing about this program is that it fixes the loop points for you automatically. You don't have to worry about that stupid rule where the loop start has to be a multiple of 14336. Now I'm waiting. I don't know what's taking so long with this thing. Huh, for some reason it didn't run. Let's see what happened. Uh, I guess it's detected an antivirus. Let me check this thing. Let's pause this. All right, my antivirus software saw this as a threat, so and the market is safe. All right, try this again. Drag and drop the L wave onto BRSTM Make. And huh, let's see what happens. All right, I'll just run this from my flash drive then. Drag and drop the L wave. Your STM make. Well, so a threat. Let's try your STM make pause. All right, I think I should be good now. All right, I'm gonna drag and drop this L wave onto BRSTM make. And, eh, that was wrong. All right, for some reason, um, the computer I'm using detects the program as virus, so. All right, but normally, as soon as you drag and drop the L wave onto BRSTM make, it'll automatically make the BRSTM in that same folder as the L wave. All right, and I open the resulting BRSM in Brawl box. I'm going to test the loop. Make sure you have the loop point uh, box checked. All right, and it's seamless. And that's how you, well, that's my method of looping songs manually. I'll make another video on converting streams, songs that already have loop data in them, directly to BRSTM. Alright, thanks for watching.